Bruce here from Panasonic and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the Google Assist Voice Assistant on your Panasonic TV. Now this video applies to any Panasonic TV that's running the Google TV operating system, so the W70, W80 or the NX800. So let's get started. On your remote control you'll find that you have a Google Assist button, that's the one that looks like the Google Assistant. When you press and hold this button you can command your TV to control certain functions turn the volume up and down, change the channels, that kind of stuff. One thing that's really useful is you can also use it to open up apps or search apps for certain types of content. Now one thing to note, your TV will obviously need to be connected to a network uh, and be set up with your Google Gmail account or a Google account. So you can't use any of these features if you've set up your TV in basic mode. Let's give this a go now. Show me some action movies. Yeah, look at that. So you can get some action movies. This is stuff that's on Netflix, Prime, Prime Netflix. Now, if you have a W80 or an NX800, you'll also notice that there's a far field microphone underneath the TV. So you can actually yell out to your Google Assistant, hey Google, play relaxing music on the PMX802. should come through. Yeah, nice. Hey Google, stop playing music. Yeah, so you can use the Google Assistant built into your TV to control your smart home, so lights and switches and other smart appliances, or cast content or media to other cast enabled devices like the Panasonic PMX802. If you've got a TV model with a far field mic, you can also turn off that particular function with the hard switch. So if you don't want Google listening in or you don't want to be yelling it out because it interferes with other Google enabled devices like a phone or a Google HomePod, then you can turn off that switch on the bottom of the TV. Well, that's it for this video. If you are looking for more information, please check out Panasonic.com or check out some of our other videos on YouTube. Thanks for watching. See you next time.